All right, so a lot of people ask me, hey, Art, after you have your lemon turmeric water, what's the second thing you drink in a day? Actually, nobody asked me that. It'd be funny if they did. If they did, I would tell them the second thing that I drink every day is like matcha green tea. And what I'm going to show you uh, today is how I make a matcha latte that's uh, dairy free. So, what I do, I fill a cup up about two thirds. I'm thinking I might have filled that a little too much, but about two thirds. Um, and then I add some rice milk. And even though this rice milk uh, has no sugar added, it does have sugar in it because it's rice. And rice is a carbohydrate. And so you can see right here, 10 grams of sugar in one cup. So what this is going, going to do is one, cool it down because you don't want to put matcha tea in boiling hot water. Uh, it's going to add some sweetness. Um, and this flax oil is going to add a little richness, just a few drops. All right, man, what I do is I add that to the Nutribullet. Right then I add my scoop, scoop, where is it, right there, of matcha tea to this. If you add it to the cup, then it will stick to the sides. All right, so remember that. Then put the lid on. And it's time to blend that up in the Nutra bullet. Let's see, get a good angle on this here. All righty, make sure it's tight or it'll spill out. It doesn't take a long time. But you know, on that neutral bullet, but if you do it like the old fashioned way using this and this, it takes forever and you don't really get a good job. I'm some people might give me, give me grief for saying that, but um, I've learned. Ugh. I've learned to use this. So, there you go. That makes a nice, frothy, uh, tasty drink. Now, I find the rice milk more than enough to sweeten it up. For people with a sweet tooth, just a few drops of maple syrup in there before you blend it up. Of course, sweetens it up some more, but remember the idea behind this is it's really alkalizing and this is acidifying. So, you know, it depends why you're drinking it. If you want to uh, have a tasty treat, add maple syrup. If you want something healthy, maybe don't add the maple syrup. As a matter of fact, most of the time I don't even add that, but I wanted to make a video on how I make my matcha latte. So, there you go. That's, uh, that's what it takes. A little flax oil, rice milk, matcha tea, and you've got yourself a nice, healthy matcha latte uh, that's dairy-free. Enjoy.